A daughter converts to Islam and keeps the decision from her mum because she I didn't want to hurt her feelings. Please listen to a story in her own words. I converted to Islam on June 24, 2007, and I kept my decision from my mum because I didn't want to hurt her feelings and I didn't know how she'd react when she found out. It was easy to hide living in another city while attending college, and I chose to not wear a hijab in the beginning. I knew that wearing it was a huge decision, and I didn't want to take it lightly. I knew that once I put it on, I didn't want to take it off. Seven months later, a new semester was starting. I was so focused on Islam, making my prayers on time and staying away from haram. But there was one thing missing. No one knew I was a practicing Muslim. So I made the decision to put the hijab on. During my last semester in college, my friend and I decided, we wanted to backpack Europe together after graduation, and before starting our careers. I had never traveled outside the United States before, so I needed to apply for my first passport. Little did I know. They sent the extra picture back to you, and that's how my new identity was revealed to my mother. I had sent in my application, and a few weeks later, my mom called me to tell me there was an envelope in the mail for me. Not knowing what it was, I told her to go ahead and open it. My mom said, it's a picture of you with a shawl around your head, why are you wearing that? My stomach turned. I explained to her that, I converted to Islam, and wear the hijab. I told her I was scared to tell her because I didn't know how she'd react. I explained that Islam gives high importance to your mother. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, stated that the one most worthy of companionship is the mother, three times before mentioning the father. Leaving that conversation over the phone. I felt a huge burden lifted off my shoulders. I was no longer living a secret life, and thought I could be free with my mom now. Over the course of a few years we had some difficulties with my faith, but nothing unlivable. I had a good daily routine, work, gym, and back home for dinner. I come across an Iraqi young man in this gym. After courting each other, for a couple of months, because a dating in Islam is forbidden. We agreed to get married. There wasn't much of a proposal, but we had an engagement party, where we had our Islamic marriage contract performed. My mom thought things were moving too fast, because she didn't know Moose well. After our engagement, my family got more time, to get to know my new fiancé. He attended my grandpa's birthday, and other family festivities, and everyone grew to love him. Now we have been married going on seven years and have two beautiful children together. My mother is a proud grandma, and my best friend. We talk almost daily, and FaceTime often. Even though we have gone through a lot of hardships, in the beginning of my journey, we wouldn't be where we are now, if it weren't for those hard times. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share.